popular Cryptocorini parva is an attractive and relatively small plant, the smallest of all Cryptocorini. It is found in the wild, grown as a marsh plant, along with Cryptocorini ex willisii and Cryptocorini becketii in the central highlands of Sri Lanka. It grows in dense patches on the banks of fast-moving rivers where the water is very soft and with a temperature ranging from between 23 and 28 Celsius. Recent reports suggest its scarcity in the wild may now consider it an endangered species, although it does not yet appear on the IUCN Red List of Threatened Species at the time of writing. Its common name is the dwarf or small water trumpet due to the shape of its flower when growing immersed. Originally the name Cryptocorini nevelii was applied to both Cryptocorini parva and Ex willisii alike, but they are now recognised as different species, with Cryptocorini parva being the smallest. Cryptocorini parva is a medium category rosette plant that comes supplied by Tropica as a pot where it is sustainably grown in our greenhouses. It's a very slow growing species, even in optimal conditions with good access to nutrients from its roots and leaves, CO2 injection and strong lighting. It does require moderate to high lighting to thrive and a nutrient rich substrate and good liquid fertilisers are essential to maintain healthy growth. The plant forms lateral shoots directly from its rhizome as well as producing runners. If given enough time it can form a solid foreground carpet but you should expect this to take several months depending on how many plants you start with. Remove the plant from the pot then split apart the two halves of rock wool. Remove as much of the rock wool as possible. Split the plant into several portions. Plant into your substrate with aquascaping tweezers. Cryptocorini parva makes an ideal foreground plant for all sizes of aquariums. It looks very attractive planted in small groups or as a solid lawn effect. Mixing it with other foreground species can achieve a natural effect, but beware that due to its very slow growing nature, the other carpeting species may eventually smother it. Cryptocorini parva is such a slow grower that maintenance levels are very low. In the early stages you may experience the well-known crypt melt phenomenon as it adapts to its new underwater life from its immersed state. Simply remove the affected leaves and new growth will soon occur after, providing your aquarium conditions are appropriate. It does best in a nutrient-rich substrate, but will also grow well in sand or gravel if tropical nutrition capsules are added to near the roots. Feed the leaves regularly with a liquid fertiliser, such as premium or specialised nutrition, to ensure there are no nutrient deficiencies. Its slow growth can lead to algae growth on its leaves, so consider stocking some algae eaters, such as Amano shrimp and Nearite snails. The small yet beautiful Cryptocorini parva is a classic slow growing and low maintenance foreground plant suitable for all sizes of planted aquariums and aquascapes. Given good light and nutrients and plenty of patience, this wonderful crypt will reward you with the attractive leaf shape and bright green colour that we are sure you will enjoy for the entire life of your planted aquarium.